me because I'm going to keep it real with you. A lot of people could talk about you tough, you really like that, and you're doing a whole lot. And I'm not trying to sound like super tough guy, but I spent most of my life running around Rikers Island and in different prisons. Facts. And, it's, and it don't make you a bigger man. It don't make you a tough guy. We don't glorify that. But I know for a fact that from the looks of the people that I've seen out there, I'm not talking about everybody. You're not going to be able to hold it down in that yard, facts, when all eyes on you. What's going on, beautiful people of YouTube and the internet and worldwide, New York City, Chicago, Mexico, Colombia, Panama, the UK, shout out to the UK, I love you guys, thanks for your support, but we have a lot to talk about today because in reality, in real time, there's a lot going on. So, one of the things while I'm here just relaxing at home, trying to think about things of life and what is become or what is it going to become, what is our future or my future going to be like, right? It's bugged out because my brain starts to go like, oh, over the blaze, right? Boom. Because, <laughs> yeah, I see dudes playing too much at times. <laughs> like everything is a game, but in reality, it's not. Because you end up in prison, Rikers Island, and then you're uncomfortable when a correction officer is telling you what to do. But we're going to get into that. But first, I wanted to touch a little bit on the basics. You know, just a little on the surface. Because you don't want to get too crazy with these people, you heard? Because they try to like, boom, boom, gang up on you as if you're doing something that nobody else is not. With that being said, man. And if you listen, by the way, if you're not understanding what I'm saying, it's cool. Because I don't even understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Let's go, lock out. We that ganga. So listen, one of the things that I'm liking that's happening right now, of course, we kind of like not too. F listen, a lot of people are putting out. How could we say it? Misrepresentation, false information. That could lead to your incarceration. So why cry later when you're doing this to yourself? Are you oh Lord, brother please with it? <laughs> you're bugging out, bro. <laughs> so, Poppy, check this one out, right? I wake up, bing, 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 bing. But oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, rewind. <laughs> so now I wake up. No, no, wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. I, I, why did I go back to that? Wake up. Am I asleep? No, we woke over here. So uh, I'm watching this thing that's going on, right? Everything. We don't want to get too much into it because if you, you keep talking about that, if you want to, bro, <laughs> shout out to all the. Channels that will not be around every time I say something. I'm not saying it because I'm making it up. Or oh, I'm a crazy lunatic dude that don't have nothing else better to do but be on here and act the fool. One of the things I never do, I never make fake content. I never take a situation of our people or any people to make it beneficial to me to where I'm rigging in dough. If I did that, I'll have the most lit channel in the, or channels because I have more than one in the century. And I speak 27 languages. So I would be super lit. Huh? Right? You like, holy snap. Son, get busy. Son, speak 27 different idiomas, which is languages in Spanglish, right? 
<laughs> you know us Puerto Ricans. We don't speak Spanish. We speak Spanglish, so check it out. Let's stop playing. I don't speak 27 languages. But you will be gassed and be like, yo, I told son is a smart dude, son. Son is from the hood, son, and he learned all this, uh, 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 right? Son used to, you know what I mean? Like, I, he was in everything. Son was, you know, you, you might be bigging it up, or you might be on, man, I know son, but, man, he ain't about nothing, man, he fronting on here. I know him in real time. I went to school with him 17 years ago. You know, like, like, bro, in 17 years, bro, a whole lot has changed, bro. So check it out, right? I say all that to say that. We just get a little hype. You feel me? We got to. We got to. Um, I say all that to say that we hear something. We hear somebody say something online, on the internet, on YouTube, and we jump to it. We believe it. Boom. It's the facts. It's the truth. It's stamped. Yo, I'm telling you, homeboy said it. Because you've been following this dude for a long time and his word to you is gold. It's golden. His word is everything to you. Or if he's a gang member or whatever, he'd be like, unplug, uncut my crown, whatever. I, I get it. So, I'm going to get back to that right now. Hold on. Because I... I was feeling the situation when they went up there. The dude's in charge of this world, right? You already know. Supposedly, right? That the internet is going to be super regulated like they're going to try to regulate the streets. And I'm going to keep it 100. I kept saying that. I kept telling people, get on this now before they did it because our people mess up everything for ourselves and when i say our people i mean blacks i mean puerto ricans i mean spanish i mean the hood the gutter the slums the people that ah, 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 right the killers the hundred dollar billers the tough guys so guess what and it's not only the tough guys because a lot of these intelligent super you know dudes that's online is causing a lot of this stuff. So when they say they're going to regulate it, you just ain't going to be able to be posting like that no more. Hi, welcome to the real world. What you thought was going to happen? That they was going to let you keep putting out misinformation out there. Nothing was going to happen. It may not happen today where they fix it. It may not happen tomorrow. But I guarantee you, you're going to remember me that you're not just going to be able to get online like that or post no, on YouTube, no on nowhere. You're going to have to be a partner. You're going to have to be somebody who made it. And I know in order, so how could you make it if you can't post videos? But you're not going to post a hidden agenda. You're not going to post a negativity. You're not going to none of that. And I'm with that. Because when you put in our misinformation, it's not only because it's done uh, from people from my community. It's done with every community, man. And it, and it, and it affects lives, man. And people that really care, man, you're a creep when you do that just for views and to generate an income. You playing dirty because you mad because the dude that you consider your ops when he was with you probably in a prison or somewhere else, his team, you still trying to cause confusion because you mad at what happened with that individual. And one individual or a few individuals ain't got nothing to do with a whole group of people. Facts. Everybody's not the same. That's why we have individual brains. Every mind is a different world. Every head is a different world. Cada cabeza es otro mundo. You heard facts. So... That made me happy. Like, I, they paying attention because I was saying, what's making all this happen in this world? All this confusion and people not knowing what's going on and the lies about this and that. It's the internet, bro. All these people that can't be, they was back there, these robots, these, these, these dudes that they just type, those, those typey gangsters, they came out. You saw what they look like? They weren't our people from our block. You saw what they look like? 
The trolls, you saw them, but then you got dudes that we do know on certain pages, and you filter in that early this morning. I get up, boom, holy snap, I'm in the house, right? Normal. I'm thinking about our brothers in the jail system. I'm thinking about everything. So, while I'm thinking about that, I see that the, um, the yellow team is all over the news. And I mean like on the tube, right? And I'm like, what's going on? And it's like, you know, Hispanics, uh, 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 uh doing, you know, getting at other, at dark people, you know, at the, not even at the red team, it's just, and anybody that they was, I guess they was trying to protect their hood in Chicago. And a dude that came out talking right away, people seen a Spanish doing. He looked like he was a little tough, a gangster, whatever. And they said, "I'm not standing up or defending for no one. I'm not like a a spokesman for for no for no organization or no name, none of that. I'm Warpath from on the lockout. But what I do care is about you as a person, and I care about myself, and I care about blacks, Puerto Ricans, because I always believe we are black, bro." So you're bugging out right now. So with that being said is people that is starting this controversy is the same tubers, bro. It's the influence. You guys don't get it, bro. They're putting fake news out there to you, bro. The person recording is starting fake news because you could, the people that are recording homeboys like, I'm not even a gang member, dude. I'm just, oh my God. Oh, oh, he's getting the gun, man. Yo, the landing, the landing kings are out here bugging out, man. And meanwhile, the dude that spoke and was like, yo, y'all better stay out my hood. He not even king. And for those of you that don't know, I'm going to just keep it real. From what I know, you bugging like all oh, racist. Go Bro, people, those people that made those bad agendas, those are people that had something against them. There is blacks out there, bro, that are king. You're bugging. Like, do your research. That's all I'm saying, man. That, that's all I'm saying. Look. You could be right in certain aspects. You could be wrong in certain aspects. Cool. But do your research. Just don't listen to your regular tuber. That's all I'm saying. And I'm not in nobody's pocket hating on nobody. But right now, at this time, people are taking this opportunity for their own things that they disliked about somebody, about certain groups. And they're like, okay, now it's on. And it's bad. Those are opportunists. Don't let people eat your brain like that. You're better than that. You're bigger than that. We're special. You're special. And if you making content or if you ever thought about making content, you super special. So why let, don't get, don't get rotten like that. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's bad. It looks bad. And they about to shut down. Listen, the best thing that they could do, I'm going to keep it a hundred is shut the internet down. This is what's starting a lot of problems, but not, they're going to shut it down. And I'm, I'm, let me rephrase that and say the right. They're going to shut it down, but not everybody's going to be able to make content. So when I told you get on this now, remember my man is putting in orders to switch what's going on on Twitter and all social media platforms. Facts that's putting out fake news. There's going to be a problem. Soon, like I told you, if you're a felon, you're not going to be able to be on here because what they do, they blame our people always. So, cool. Let's get with it, but let's get it right, man. And I'm not, like I said, look, don't get it wrong. I know incidents has happened, this and that, but right now, everybody else is using this situation for their own thing. That's all I'm saying, and that's what I see. But prison, Rikers Island, and all that is getting packed. You already know de Blasio has a problem. We're going to move right on from that because what happens is that right now you got people that are watching and they don't even understand. They just think that, oh, you're defending because you used to be involved in that or whatever, boom, boom, boom. Or when you was in jail, you was that, whatever. And I'm not. I'm with what's right. But when I hear somebody say, oh, the people in Chicago, what they doing right now is they being racist. They targeting every black dude. Bro, there's kings that are black. Facts. All over the world. So you're bugging. You're bugging. That would not happen. How could you be king in a lot? That's not going to happen. You're bugging. But... Probably an incident happened. You don't know the whole story. So you see a little half a clip of video. And we get mad at what we saw because it's our people that looks like they're losing. But if it was like your people and if you was of that, of, you know, if you came from the same place, 
and they was winning, you wouldn't you wouldn't have such a big problem with it. You'd be cool. That's that's all I'm saying. That we gotta know what's real and what's fake, man. We can't just take this opportunity to vent our own past histories we have with certain people or whatever and be like, you know what, F all of them. Because now somebody else hears that and you generate a chain reaction and you put something, some poison in somebody else's heart and they go out and they really live while you're just talking about doing. Because they really like that and you're not. Because you're just behind the mic and in your room typing away and recording and you never go outside. But they go outside and now they the ones out there like, oh, snap, because you the you the bigger YouTuber or content creator or whatever you think you're doing with school. I'm not a hate. We all in the same field. But you got to watch what you filter down. Let's not do this, my dudes. For real, that's ugly. That's bad. That's not a way to come up online. Like I see, I see a lot of people doing it. Facts. Dudes know that if you put that in the title, you amping up the situation. Oh, two gangs, oh, they're going at it because this gang is holding down their hood and this, and you use that as an opportunity to generate an income and grow online, my dude. Use a creep. You, you playing dirty. You're part of the reason our people are no longer are dying and vanishing and becoming and being looked at as monsters. And when I say our people, I mean all people because we keep it 100 with the fact that we love all people. You see, at times, I just go to see what's going on, man. And I've always said they got to change these rules for this, bro, if this is going to work. Because I knew that these problems were going to come because I kept saying them. And whoever knows me and has been around my pages and following me for years, for over a decade online, doing these platforms and, and podcasting, hit in the comments and tell me if I'm bugging out, if I didn't say this, that dudes was going to create problems for everybody with, <laughs> with all this. And they're going to dead it. I've been saying that. It's coming. It's very near. If this is what you plan on doing for a profession, don't start off like that. Those are gonna, those are the first people that are being looked at right now during all this. There's gonna be charges, incarceration, Rikers Island, prison. It's gonna be a whole lot going on because people are taking this as an opportunity, they feel, to uh, use cameras. And try to open up platforms, or you know, try to open up channels or platforms to put out fake information. So that's not gonna rock. And then when they on Rikers Island, and they in one of these buildings on the on Rikers Island, right? They gonna be crying. So why put yourself through all that when you know you're not trying to see these barbed wires? You're not trying to get to Rikers Island. You feel me? Because I'm going to keep it real with you. A lot of people could talk about you tough, you really like that, and you're doing a whole lot. And I'm not trying to sound like super tough guy. But I spent most of my life running around Rikers Island and in different prisons. Facts. And, it's, and it don't make you a bigger man. It don't make you a tough guy. We don't glorify that. But I know for a fact, that from the looks of the people that I've seen out there, I'm not talking about everybody. You're not going to be able to hold it down in that yard, facts, when all eyes on you. You're not. You're going to start crying. You may not even make it to the yard. You might lock in from the minute you get there. Like, you know, see, oh, how can I get in a cell by myself? What are you talking about? Um, I got problems in the building. You might just start saying you got problems in the building from the muscle. You're going to tell you you got to go to PC. You're going to be like, what's that? You're going to be like, punk city. <laughs> and you're not even going to dispute it. You're going to say, how I, what I got to do to get there? I'm alone there in a the cell? And that's where you're going to go, bro. Because most of the time when I was in these yards and in these prison or jail cells, Rikers Island, up north, Whatever penitentiary I went to, I'm going to keep it 100. 
Most of the dudes that was with me in the street and were tough and had a name and was getting money was soft when they got locked up. Facts. And the ones you thought were soft in the streets or a little, you know, at, were monsters. The ones that were running around, uh, getting high and all that, that people, when you got locked up, dude be like, yo, who running the house? Him right there. you like, him? He used to buy crack for me. Yeah, bro, you got to talk to him. He not playing. <laughs> huh? Tell me I'm bugging. Tell me I'm bugging. Tell me I'm bugging. Anybody right now, tell me I'm bugging out with that. Tell me I'm bugging out with that. Tell me, I'm, tell me, tell me what I'm saying is not facts. Leave it in the comments. And most of the time, it's like that. I mean, since I've been getting locked up, and guys, I haven't, I'm not one of them dudes that come back and be like, and no disrespect to nobody, just facts. I see it a lot happening. Or oh, I'm from the other side of the world. You know, I'm OG, killer warpath. Uh, uh, and I just come back from the dead because I see my other people making money online. I want to get down and all that. And I want to make money too. And I figure this is the way getting at the... I don't do those. You heard? <laughs> a lot of dudes, man, listen, they be like, I'm an OG. Why? That's not OG what you are, bro. Papi, I'm sorry. What you are is an OT. You're confusing uh, the terminology. You're an OT, an old timer. Facts. To become an OG, that needs to be earned. That's not just given because of age. That's given through pain, work, and super hard times in the struggle, which a lot of people really don't know nothing about. They heard. So once they heard, they repeat. Let's keep it a hundred, bro. And then we start thinking online that a dude, in order for him to be the real gangster one, he has to have mad tattoos all over. And all respects to people that do it. He needs to be a big dude. Uh. But when you go to Rikers Island, you know what time it is in New York. In New York, we different. We special. Facts. And shout out to everybody. Chicago, UK, I love you guys. Portland, everywhere. But Rikers Island, there be a dude this little. Having it smashed. Facts. Tell me I'm lying. You ain't never seen a midget. Or, you know, with all respects to him, but way shorter than you. Running the whole house. Facts. I was there. To refrain from names. Dudes respected him. Whether he was down with son or not. Leave in the comments if you know what I'm talking about. And I'm not the tallest of dude in the world either. And a lot of these real OGs that I even identify with from other cliques. They not tall either. So, you know, don't get it one thing confused. Like you got to be a big dude and... That's why people get things confused with. But shout out the big dudes, bro. Not all of them is sweet about them. But the majority, they just a little more laid back. They don't push their weight around like that. That's how whatever higher power is up there, that's how he made us even to a certain extent. Because if he made big dudes with a super big heart like the little dudes, they'll be considered super monsters. So it evens out the balance of life. If you get what I'm saying or you don't. Even the comments if you don't. <laughs> Because sometimes I don't either myself. Let's get it though, right? So, you got to stop uh, watching this fake situation. You know, like fake news that's going on. That's all I'm saying, man. You know, because Rikers Island is not going to be sweet for nobody, bro. And right about now, Rikers Island you know, is getting packed and packed as the days go by. Because once you see that sign and they bringing you into the jail at Rikers Island, everything changes. Once you start crossing that bridge, my dude, you thinking like, wow, where they taking me to? If you never been there, so wake up, my man. Because even what you're doing online that may deem to you like there's nothing wrong that you amping shit up that you, or you making situations occur could turn into a case, my dude. And you'd be like, yo, I didn't know they could do that. Yeah, but we didn't know that you would do that either. You know? So we got to think, man, before we act. And that's just a fact, man. Check yourself, man. Don't be like these other people that you trying to grow online 
we're making a bad situations for others, man. It's not cool when you behind that brick wall. You feel me? Love yourself, man, and learn how to respect others and let other people live. Of course, you see a lot of things happening. Those people will be dealt with. But to keep spreading it because you see somebody else, oh, he put that up. He put up what su that su Duke that said all that was from a whole different gang, from a whole different prison gang. Facts. And Duke started it off with, yo, it's these people. I watch. I watch everything. Don't be fooled, man. To the ones that watch me and got love for me, I love you, bro. Whether you black, green, purple, wherever you from. Facts. Whatever gang you, you with. I love you because you're a human being. Facts. Don't, don't be tricked. Don't be tricked. Don't be tricked, bro. You can't blame a whole group of people for a four or five people. It's just facts. And always remember that one man, don't matter who he is, he can't stop everybody from being bozos in the world if that's what they want to do. But we're not all the same in life. And you can't judge everybody like that. If you GD, I love you. If you blood, I love you. If you crip, I love you. Shout out to my patrias. I seen what they was doing in the Bronx. The the the, the Dominicans. Uh, um, you already know. Popote to my real dudes. Facts. You know, I'm just a real dude like that. There's different levels of life and situations. You heard? And I just love all people. And at a time like this, we need to embrace each other, man. You feel me? Whether you blood, crip, whatever you are. It's nothing about oh, it's, uh, sweet or being soft. It's about being a real dude. What's really real to you? And what's dumb? My name is Warpath, man. We special people. Puerto Ricans, blacks, we special. We've been around each other for years. Puerto Ricans, the only ones in the hood that ever had an easy pass to use the N-word. Facts. Hip-hop. We made that happen. Puerto Ricans and blacks together. Stop playing with me, man. My family, my blood, my nieces, my nephews, they black, my dude. Whoever told you that there was no KINGs that are black, you're, is giving you false information, my dude. Acknowledge yourself before you talk about gang and gang culture and don't know what's happening. Before you say someone just don't like this group of people. Before you don't know what's actually in the literature, my dude. You don't even know what's going on, so you could just speculate from the outside what you heard from another hater. Find out the facts. Let's get to the facts of what's the root of problems, and then we'll be all right. Let's stay out these prisons, out these jails, because that's the only thing that this is going to lead us to. My name is Warpath from On The Lockout. If nobody told you today that they loved you, I love you, and you special, remember that. Make content that matters. Just don't make content. Facts.